Chapter 60 Arise, Jerusalem, let your light shine for all the nations to see. For the glory of the Lord is shining upon you. Darkness as black as night will cover all the nations of the earth, but the glory of the Lord will shine over you. All nations will come to your light. Mighty kings will come to see your radiance. Look and see, for everyone is coming home. Your sons are coming from distant lands. Your little daughters will be carried home. Your eyes will shine and your hearts will thrill with joy, for merchants from around the world will come to you. They will bring you the wealth of many lands. Vast caravans of camels will converge on you, the camels of Midian and Ephraim. From Sheba they will bring gold and incense for the worship of the Lord. The flocks of Kedar will be given to you, and the rams of Nebaioth will be brought for my altars. In that day I will make my temple glorious. And what do I see flying like clouds to Israel, like doves to their nests? They are the ships of Tarshish, reserved to bring the people of Israel home. They will bring their wealth with them, and it will bring great honor to the Lord your God, the Holy One of Israel, for he will fill you with splendor. Foreigners will come to rebuild your cities. Kings and rulers will send you aid. For though I have destroyed you in my anger, I will have mercy on you through my grace. Your gates will stay open around the clock to receive the wealth of many lands. The kings of the world will be led as captives in a victory procession. For the nations that refuse to be your allies will be destroyed. The glory of Lebanon will be yours the forests of cypress, fir, and pine to beautify my sanctuary. My temple will be glorious. The children of your tormentors will come and bow before you. Those who despised you will kiss your feet. They will call you the city of the Lord and Zion of the Holy One of Israel. Though you were once despised and hated and rebuffed by all, you will be beautiful forever. You will be a joy to all generations, for I will make you so. Powerful kings and mighty nations will bring the best of their goods to satisfy your every need. You will know at last that I, the Lord, am your Savior and Redeemer, the Mighty One of Israel. I will exchange your bronze for gold, your iron for silver, your wood for bronze, and your stones for iron. Peace and righteousness will be your leaders. Violence will disappear from your land. The desolation and destruction of war will end. Salvation will surround you like city walls, and praise will be on the lips of all who enter there. No longer will you need the sun or moon to give you light, for the Lord your God will be your everlasting light, and he will be your glory. The sun will never set, the moon will not go down, for the Lord will be your everlasting light. Your days of mourning will come to an end. All your people will be righteous. They will possess their land forever. I will plant them there with my own hands in order to bring myself glory. The smallest family will multiply into a large clan. The tiniest group will become a mighty nation. I, the Lord, will bring it all to pass at the right time.